The Volkswagen Polo Vivo is one of the country's best-selling vehicles, so let's check out this latest generation range-topping GTS and see just what it has to offer. Volkswagen Polo is an incredibly top-selling vehicle within South Africa. It's economic and well put together package. Now the Polo Vivo follows the design of the previous generation Polo and comes in at not only an affordable price point, it offers a lot of bang for your buck. This one here, the range topping Vivo GTS, has some funky little extras that make it really stand out from the crowd and give it a bit of a boy racer unique feel. They start in the way of the GTS badges scattered around the body, the smoked Revazza style alloys, and when you climb inside, you get this black and red coloured cross stitching, the silver dashboard surround, as well as the black and red stitching near your gear selector. When you take a look at media and entertainment, the Vivo GTS features the Polo fairly simplistic yet functional interface. It's got Bluetooth SD card support as well as a USB thumb drive socket. But the most important thing with the Vivo GTS is how does it drive? And I'm really blown away by it. It actually drives incredibly well. Its 1.6 litre engine delivers 77 kilowatts of power and 155 newton meters of torque and it feels incredibly sprightly. Having driven a 1.4 litre manual Polo, I always knew the VW Polo to be an incredibly fuel efficient vehicle and the Vivo GTS certainly doesn't disappoint. I've now travelled all the way up to Betty's Bay Royals right along the Western Cape coastline in the Vivo GTS and all the way through I managed to, having done over 250 kilometers, not even use a quarter of a tank of fuel. Now that's really, really good fuel economy. Really exceptional when you consider the way the vehicle goes and the overall drive you're getting. You notice with the Vivo GTS, as with all vehicles in the Polo lineup, it's a very solid package. It's what you've come to expect from Volkswagen. You get good grade materials, soft touch materials on the dash, generally around the cabin and overall a comfortable solid ride. The Polo Vivo GTS features a 1.6 litre engine and it delivers 77 kilowatts of power and 155 newton meters of torque. But what's most impressive is the way it puts the power down, not only a very nippy car under urban commute, also on open roads and cruising, it overall puts the power down very nicely and makes a great engine sound too, especially when you put your foot down at lower speeds. At the end of the day, who does the Polo Vivo GTS appeal to? Well, in my opinion, it can appeal to quite a wide market. For that family looking to start out, you're getting lots of space with seats that fold down flat, an overall comfortable interior, ISOFIX mounting points in the back, airbags up front, and a lot of clever and convenient features, including air conditioning, alloys, and an MP3 player. Also, when you take its funky touches and its racing appeal, it's a great car for that young guy who wants a bit of a boy racer. The Polo Vivo GTS makes a great sound, and when you put your foot down, there's lots of power under the bonnet. With its retrograde style red and black GTS interior, it really is a lot of fun to drive. From me, Jason of Technova, until next time, I'll see you guys soon. Cheers for now. Techno Buck.